Hello friends, welcome to Rajesh Data Engineering. In this video, I'm going to solve one of the coding interview question using PySpark and Spark SQL. In our coding exercise series, this is question number six and the complexity level is easy. In my previous video, I have solved the coding exercise where employees earning more than their managers. And coming to this problem statement, we have to find the list of employees who are earning more than their department average salary. This looks quite similar to the previous one, but actually the logic is completely different compared to the previous one. Let us understand the problem statement first. Let's say I'm having employee table, which is having department name and salary for all the employees. If you look at uh, the department HR, I'm having three records, employee ID 1, 2 and 7. So I need to find the average salary for this department. So the salary 60,000, 50,000 and 45,000. These are the three different values. So I have to sum these three values and divided by three, which means it is going to give average salary for the department HR. So which is uh, going to be 51,666. Right. Now I have to find out the employees who are earning more than that average salary. Coming to Alice, she is earning more than average salary of the department. So this should be output for me. And coming to Bob or uh, Chris, they are earning lesser than the average salary of their department HR. So in this way, I have to find out for all the employees, even though they are part of different uh, department. So coming to engineering department, only Hank is earning more than the average salary of their department engineering. Coming to uh, finance, only David is earning more than the department average salary for finance. I hope you understood the problem statement. So in order to solve this um, problem statement, first what we have to do is we have to try to add average uh, department salary for all the employees along with their salary. Then it is going to be super easy. So we have to visualize in this format. This is my input data set. This is same previous data set. I have just sorted based on the department so that it is uh, easier to visualize. So here I'm having three records for department engineering, three records for finance, three records for HR. So basically I have to cal uh, calculate uh, average salary for each department and that should be associated with all the employees. So for example, first uh, three employees, they are part of engineering uh, department. So engineering average uh, salary is uh, given in this field. Coming to other people, they are part of finance. So the finance average salary is given along with their salary. So this is the first thing we have to visualize. In case we are going to get output something similar to this one, then it is very easy. We can apply uh, where condition where employee salary is greater than average salary. It's going to be very simple filter operation. I hope you understood. So uh, coming to PySpark or SQL, you know, there are various approaches to bring this average salary. But uh, in this um, uh, in this uh, walkthrough, I'm going to just uh, give explanation for only one method that is window function. Using window function, we can achieve this uh, output. And I will also uh, cover couple of other scenarios while solving using SQL. Right. Coming to visualization, once you know, we have visualized this uh, approach and uh, we can achieve this using window function, then the next step, simply we are going to filter out using where condition where salary greater than average salary. Then that is going to give expected output for this coding exercise. I hope you understood the problem statement and uh, the thought process that we should have in order to solve this problem. Let's get started with the demo. I have logged into my Databricks environment. First step, I am going to create a sample data frame. So the sample data frame is uh, going to contain the same data that I have shown in the uh, PowerPoint, which is having employee details along with the department and salary. Right. Now, first I am going to solve this problem using PySpark approach. Coming to PySpark, as I mentioned, we can go with window function. So uh, window function, basically, you know, we are having different types of window functions, rank, tens rank, row number, lead, lag, max, sum, average. So I have already posted a couple of videos in my channel. Uh, and I have uh, explained more about window function. In case you don't understand window function properly, I recommend to watch those videos before getting into this concept. Right. In PySpark, in order to use window function, first of all, we have to import that library that is part of PySpark.sql window. So that, that I have, uh, I'm importing here. And the next step, we have to create the window specification. So for that, we have to start with the keyword window. Then after that, we have to use partition by and optionally we can use uh, order by as well. 
so basically here i have to group the records based on their uh, department then i have to calculate average only for those department so for that order by that is not uh, significant or not required for this requirement that's the reason i am not using order by simply i am grouping or i am partitioning i am bucketing based on the department so here i can give any user defined variable here i am giving windows spec then in the next step using that windows spec i am applying average function which means now this window spec that is responsible to group uh, the department rec records and within that i want to calculate average based on salary column so this is how we can apply window function in pyspark then using with column function i am creating a new column which is called average salary so for each employee this particular field is going to have average department salary along with that employee salary i hope you understood so let me execute so that we can see how it is going to calculate average salary for all the employees right so this is our original data set along with my original data set i have added new column average salary using with column and it is uh, using window function based on that it is calculating uh, average salary for all the departments for example engineering it is giving 9366 right now it's going to be very uh, simple approach just i need to filter out based on the salary and average salary i have to find the employees who is earning more than their average sal uh, average department salary if you look at uh, the employee id 5 uh, the salary is 90000 but average salary which is greater so we have to ignore this one but coming to uh, the third record hank he is earning 98000 while average department salary is 93666 which means this record is eligible so i can apply simple filter operation so for um, uh, pyspark either we can use win var or filter function so within that i am uh, specifying my salary should be greater than average salary this is very simple uh, filter operation so i am executing now we can see the output only these three employees they are earning more than their department average salary and uh, in case we are interested only in employee name just i can uh, uh, i can uh, limit using select class i hope you understood this is how we can uh, how we can solve this problem using pyspark and coming to sql approach i am going to follow the same thing first i need to convert my data frame into views so here i am uh, creating a view called employees using create or replace temp view and the next step i am going to apply window function so uh, the syntax is a little bit different coming to sql and this uh, spark sql that is complaint of ansi sql standard so the same sql code can be used for any uh, sql coding interview question interview scenario right so for in order to use window function we have to specify the function name here i am going to find average then uh, i have to use avg within that which column i want to uh, find the average of salaries then i am going to give uh, salary then for uh, based on which category we have to find average salary based on each department i want to find so for that i have to give over partition by department here after department i can give order by if needed but in this exercise it's not needed that's the reason i am not giving then uh, this computed column i am going to give alias that is called average salary so let me execute this is going to give similar output which we have seen in the first step of our pyspark solution so along with our original uh, data it has added new column which is called average salary and it is giving average salary for each department right now i have to filter out for that what i am going to do is i am going to apply uh, common table expression so uh using this common table expression i am going to add the computed column using this sub query once that is done then finally i am going to apply a var condition where my employee salary is greater than average salary so this is the complete query let me execute so here we can see there are three employees who are earning more than their department average salary i hope you understood this is the the first approach and this is better approach compared to any other method and still you know the same problem statement can be resolved using different approaches so i am going to show couple of other approaches as well so in my second approach i am going to use correlated sub query in correlated sub query now the output um, of uh, each record that is uh, uh, depending on another sub query so here uh, i am having uh, one sub query which is going to calculate average salary for each department so uh, as per this sql statement it is going to calculate uh, the average department salary for record by record so for first record what it will do is it will take what is the department for that particular department it is going to calculate average salary 
then finally it is going to compare if that particular employee is earning more than average department salary so this is how this correlated sub query is working so this is another uh, approach we can use so i am executing it is going to produce same output here we can see employee name department and salary it is giving only those three employees uh, this is another approach and uh, third approach is even we can go with inner join so in the inner join what i am going to do is i am going to create one sub query where i am going to calculate only the average salary for all the departments now i am going to join this uh, data set with my employees original data set along with uh, using this department key then finally it is going to give uh, same output of my window function which i have shown earlier then uh, after that i am going to apply filter condition uh, then it is going to filter out only the employees who is earning more than average department salary so let me execute this step then we can see the output which is going to be same output right these are the three different approaches how we can uh, solve this uh, exercise using uh, spark sql or any ansi sql standard and also i have covered how to solve this problem using pyspark i hope you understood hope you enjoyed uh, this video if you like the content of this video please like and comment in the channel please subscribe this uh, channel don't forget to click on the bell button to get latest update in databricks and spark concepts and also coding uh, interview exercises thank you